Assalamu alaikum Samir Soge with you if you are into home automation you must have come across situations where you have to power a microcontroller at odd locations like a, a wall outlet or a ceilings or outdoors or project boxes and it is not easy because uh, either there is space constraint or uh, it is an odd location where you can't use a USB charger so in the past what I've done is uh, if uh, my project is at a place where at least there is a uh, bulb socket I would use a lamp champ which I have reviewed before or if I had a project in which I had to uh, control uh, electric uh, appliances uh, I used a USB charger in the project box which made it very bulky and then later on I replaced it with AC to DC module from Aliexpress which did the job in this video I'll review this AC to DC module from uh, Highlink. Uh, this uh, module is really compact and beautiful and uh, first I thought maybe it was based upon semiconductor but eventually I saw its uh, teardown and it's uh, based on uh, uh, step down transformer and uh, rectifier circuit just like any other AC to DC converter. Uh, so it takes in uh, input voltage from 100 to 240 volts AC uh, it uh, outputs 5 volt uh, at uh, uh, an average uh, current of 600 milliamps with a peak of 1 amp and that is for short durations. Uh, it has pins which you can easily uh, solder on uh, a PCB. Many manufacturers of uh, uh, IoT projects uh, are using uh, this thing. In, in their uh, circuit design like uh, Armtronics and Centura technologies. So it can be very compact and useful. Keep on watching and I'll show you how to use this in a circuit. Thank you. So in this video, uh, I'll be demoing the control of this load from the mains line. Uh, but instead of using uh, a normal switch, we will be using a relay which will be controlled by the microcontroller which is being powered by the AC to DC module. So uh, what I've done is I've taken the uh, AC line and uh, neutral and I have split using these lever nuts which are awesome and so the live goes into this block which uh, splits in, into uh, the block powering the AC to DC uh, module and it also feeds the relay through which we will be controlling the load uh, the, the neutral similarly goes to the ac to dc and after that it goes directly uh, to the load because uh, the neutral does not have to go through the relay let's power this on So I have programmed the mod, uh, microcontroller such that as soon as it boots the load will turn on. Let's uh, control it uh, using the web interface. So the IP address is 192800.28 of uh, the ESP8266 Hazza microcontroller. So it's on, I'll press it once. As you can see it has uh, turned off and it has turned on again so with this simple ac to dc module you can easily power a microcontroller at either odd locations or where there is a space constraint thanks for watching and do subscribe